Hi, okay. The reason I'm here is because of I these guys. I have to take out my contacts because they are burning. <laughs> Fair enough. I know, right? <laughs> okay, the reason I'm here is because if they smell alcohol, they got to call me because this is all I do. Oh, you can search my vehicle, my sister's roof, and my car. That sounds nasty. It's nasty. I can smell it too, it's so. Right let's... now, my passenger seat is wet. <laughs> let's get you out of there because that's all I smell, okay? Okay. Okay, what did you drink tonight? Nothing at all? Oh, no. Okay. No, no, no. <laughs> Can you kill those for me? All right, let's get out of the streets when I get ran over. Oh, go ahead. You can close your door, though, unless you want to lose it. Uh, sure. <laughs> okay, Who shot your car? Uh, I bought it with that, believe it or you not. You bought it with some bullet holes in it? Yes, I swear to God. <laughs> Hope you got a good deal. I have my sandals in the car. I'm like, barefooted. No, that's cool. <laughs> okay, just face towards me. Okay. You're going to put your feet together like this. Yeah, of course. Arms down at your side, all right? Just... Sorry. <laughs> it's fine. Just look up here. Just follow my finger. Don't move your head, okay? Yeah, fine. Okay, what did you drink? Huh? What did you drink today? I swear to God. This is all I do for a living. Oh, no, no, no. I for a long God. time. No, you, don't lie to me, please. I... Scouts honor? I swear to God. Uh, I took out my contacts that were burning. I have them in the car. Do you want me to show you? I've been doing just DWIs. Oh, no, no. For 10 years almost. I'm going to school for... Being a police officer. Okay, then why are you lying to me then? I'm not lying to you, I swear to God. All I do for a I living. I swear to God. Okay, alright, let's finish this up then. Okay. <laughs> Gotta keep going. <laughs> it's okay. As long as you get the contact out. Sorry. Okay, try to keep your head still, okay? Now. All right. Do you have any medical problems? I have a slight impairment. Of what do you my mean? Voice. Impairment. Of your voice, though? Not my voice, but my speech. Speech impairment. Oh, okay. It's embarrassing. But <laughs> no, no, me too. I'm it's sorry. no big deal. It's embarrassing. No, I have one too, so I'm not worried about my that either. My mom had it, though. That's fair. All right, we're going to use this sidewalk, okay? Just go ahead and back up a little bit, though, oh, yeah, so we can have more room. Of course, sir. Okay, so what you're going to do is put your right foot. Right. Stay this way, though. There you go. Just put your right foot in front of your left, okay. touching heel to toe, just like this. Okay, but you're going to put your right foot in front of your left. There you go. Okay, that is your starting position, okay? It's important that you maintain that position while I explain sir. the test, okay? All right, so but you got to stay in that position, though. Okay. Okay, so right when here. I tell you to begin, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps, so it's going to look just like this. One, two three, and so on, all the way out to nine. Once you get to nine, your left foot's forward, leave it stationary in the middle of the sidewalk, and just step out and take short choppy steps turning around to your left. Stop, stop. Once you turn around, take nine more. One, two, three, and so on, back out to nine. Okay. Do you understand so far? Okay. Okay, it's important that throughout the test, you keep your arms down at your I side. I really want to be a police officer. <laughs> okay. Like, so I swear. Keep your arms down at your side. Okay, sir. Watch your feet and count each step out loud, okay? Okay. And once you've started the test, do not stop. Do you understand? All right, you can begin whenever you're ready. Foot in front of your left. Right. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, four. That's kind of hard. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
I can't give you more instructions once you've started. I'm sorry. Okay, ready? Right, first, right? Yes. Okay. Right? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Right. Okay, this time with your feet together. Your arms okay. down at your side. Okay. okay. You're gonna lift whichever foot of your choice, right or left, about six inches off the ground, okay? Okay. So, but while doing so, keep both legs straight. Okay. Point your toe downwards. So you're gonna look just like this. As you hold it up, look down at that toe and count 1,001, 1,002, and keep counting out loud until I tell you to stop. Okay. Any questions? No, sir. All right, you can begin whenever you're ready. Okay. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, 1,006, 1,007. Ah! Got to keep it up. Oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry. 1001, 1002, 1003, 1004, 1005, 1006, 1007, 1008, 1009, 1010, 1011, 1012, 1013, 14, 1014, 1015, 1016, 1017. Okay, yes, what's up? My leg. What's up with your ankle? It's my leg. I know, what's wrong with your leg? I got in a... Intersection. Huh? I got in a crash. This okay. is hurting me so bad. Okay, let's try something more cognitive, okay? Okay. You're going to go from H to X going forward through the alphabet, just don't sing it. H? Hmm? H-I-J-K-L-M-N-L-P-Q-R-S-D-U-V-W-S-Y-N-Z. Okay, count down from 67 down to 41. 67, 66, 55, Forty nine, forty eight, forty seven, forty six, forty five, forty four, forty three, forty two, forty one, forty. Okay. Anything else, sir? No, that's it. I really wanted me to share. Okay. <laughs> I'm like Here's the here's the problem though. My whole life on candid camera. Yeah, of course. Um they smell it, I smell it. I mean I know you drank because I can smell you. I swear to God. Smell my car, please. I smelled your car. It's different out here, though. That's what I'm saying. Are you serious? Seriously, I can still smell you out here. Oh my God. Um, plus, oh my this God. is all I do for a living. It's yeah, just this. I understand. So that. it's really, really evident to me. For and okay. Um, so what this comes down to is how much alcohol is in your system. Okay. <laughs> uh, if anything's in my system, it is Nyquil and Nyquil. Okay. Because I have allergies. I have. It's a lot of Nyquil then. Okay, you smell like liquor, not like NyQuil. I swear really. to God. Padre Santos, all the good stuff. No, it's NyQuil. Um, what it comes down to is how much alcohol is in your system, okay? I already know you drank, it's just a matter of how much. No. You want to prove it to me? I have a breath machine in, 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 in my car. Do you really want to prove it to me? No, I know that because I took this test. Okay, so... You and I both know it's going to show positive for alcohol. No, I'm in test. You know it's going to show positive for alcohol. So... Let's not go there. Um, like I said, after running down there, you'll have to blow into a machine down there. It's required by law. The one in my car, it's not accurate. It just tells me if you have alcohol, yes or no. Um, it's going to show you. You want me to call my sister because my son has a high fever? That's not going to help. He has a high fever. So that's why I was late. I don't think we're going to call your sister because she's just puked in your car. She's not very helpful to us. No, no, no. This is my older sister. Okay. That has my son. All right. We'll deal with that later. But she's okay taking care of your son though for now? What do you mean you don't know? You don't yes, trust her? At five. Okay, we'll have to deal with that as well because I can't let you go. Yeah, of course. All right, I gotta run you down there. We're gonna go from there. Any questions? No, that's okay. My job's real simple. It's either oh, there or it's I not. I know. I've been through the training. I've been through everything. All right, I gotta put you in cups, okay? You got real small wrists, so they're gonna be kind of odd shaped by the time they clamp down on you, okay? Why? Because this is what I have to do. This is crazy. It's actually very simple. I have four year olds. Okay. We all have kids, but yeah. we're not out drinking and driving, though. I'm not drinking and driving. We'll find out when we get down there when we have no. you blow. No. Okay? Okay. All right, ma'am. Go to place that way for me. i got to put you in cups, okay?
All right, we're going to go back to that black and white car back there. Uh, you get it released? Okay, cool. I know I will. Okay. Cool. And my shoes? Are you shoes? Oh, I'll go back and grab them. Um, this complicates that because they're going to watch a bunch of these videos and they're going to... I think I am doing good, so I don't know. As long as you don't... Well, the problem is you've already lied to us and that's instant termination from the How? process. Uh, we'll see. All right, I gotta read you one, two, and three that's in red up here. You need to listen to me about say something important. You're under arrest right now for DWI. The New Mexico Employee Consent Act requires you to submit to a breath test, a blood test, or both to determine the alcohol or drug content of your blood. Okay. After you take one or both of our tests, you have a right to choose an additional independent test. Okay. If you choose to take the additional independent test, uh -huh. you have a right to a reasonable opportunity mm -hmm. to arrange for a physician, licensed nurse, laboratory technician or technologist who is employed by a hospital physician of your own choice to perform the additional chemical test. The cost of this for independent test is going to be paid for by us, by so APD. So, right now, what happens after this? Um, well, at this point... Whatever happens, what happens after that? Well, right now, I just need you to make up your mind if you want to take this breath test. And okay. Number four, I cannot <laughs> force you to take our test, but if you refuse, you will lose your New Mexico driver's license or non-resident operating privileges in the state of New Mexico for a period of one year. If you're convicted in the court of law of driving under the influence, you may also receive a greater sentence because you refuse to be tested. Do you understand? All right. Do you want to take this test? Uh, yeah. Your choice. <laughs> You're the one that said you didn't drink. <laughs> Actually, yes. Really? Really. We bring in people with no clothes sometimes. What? It happens. Sometimes we find people oh with no clothes God. either. That's disgusting. You're telling me. Yeah. All right, this machine requires two breath samples. It'll take one, it'll recalibrate itself, then verify your results by taking a second sample. Okay. And then go from there. Any questions? Nothing. Okay. Alright, it's your first sample of two. Deep breath, blow really hard for about eight seconds. We gotta blow real hard, and that's not hard enough. Keep going and 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 stop. Do it again in a minute, and we're gonna go from there. I think he's talking to me. I think he might be talking to me. I was like, why is he yelling at me? He should be yelling at you, JJ. I don't understand why he's yelling at me. I don't even know the guy. I see that. I'm just over here doing my job and he's got to start picking on me. Why are you picking on me? Are you a bully, sir? I know, me and you both. We're going to have to hold it, okay? You're going to have to. Then uh, you're going to end up having to pee on yourself. Just hold it. We're almost done. We'll be done here in about a minute and a half. 
I don't think I'd be mad at you. It's your, no, I'm thinking too mad at you. It's your responsibility to hold your urine. Trust me, I gotta go too. I've had to go for the last hour. But I had to come deal with you. One thing about this job you're gonna learn, you uh, kinda have to go to the bathroom when you get a chance, and that's not very often, unfortunately. All right, same thing, deep breath, but really hard for about eight seconds. Okay, whenever you're ready. I'm doing it. You're not. I am. Uh, the machine tells us when you're blowing. You're not blowing. There we go. Keep going and going. You're not blowing hard enough. Okay, blow for eight seconds. You're not blowing hard. Just like the first time. So don't change it up. Just blow really hard for eight seconds. I'm changing anything. I need to change It's consistent. It always works the same. That's the best thing about the machine. Whenever you're ready. I know, but you got to get this done, then you can go to the bathroom, unfortunately. I, sorry, it's not an option right now. If you don't want to take it, let me know, okay? You understand the consequences? Okay, I can't force take our test, but if you refuse, you will lose your New Mexico driver's license or non-resident offering privileges in the state of New Mexico for a period of one year. If you're convicted in the court of driving under the influence, you may also receive a greater sentence because you refuse to be tested. Do you understand? Do you still wish to refuse this test now? Okay, so you do want to refuse it now? Okay, we have to wait for the machine to time out, so just stand by. No, it's fine. It's your choice. Either way, we're going to be... Either way, we have to stand here the same period of time. Okay. Next thing, my car is gone. By the way, your first sample was a .13. Way over the legal limit. Really? Really. Shocking. Who would have known? I would agree, especially since you've been lying to me since the get-go. Um, whatever you say. I understand that. We've already gone over that. All right, let me know if you, change, if you want to change your mind before the machine times out. You've only got about a minute. You want to take the second sample? You either take it or you don't. There's consequences. Okay. I would agree. You're going to be over no matter what. Yeah, okay. I hope he's really good. No, I'm not. I'm glad you went to school for a law degree. I already told you what the process is. Man, don't make excuses. You've already been caught lying. You've already been caught lying. Yeah, yeah, I know. Thanks for giving us the first sample. Unfortunately, you have to. Yep. Bathroom's on your left. Your other left? There we go. You can accuse me of whatever you like.
What? Really? Did she tell you the same story about how she's in the process to be a, a sheriff and all kinds of stuff? Yeah. I kind of figured. She was somewhat familiar with the process. I, I, I kind of figured. That and she's been lying to me since the get-go. I mean, nothing she's told me is true. That's the same story she told me. I have to go. She said something about she has to go because her older sister called her or something like that. That's kind of weird. Wow, isn't that a, co a weird coincidence? I know, shocking. What'd she blow this time? Or yours? Because she, she's a 1-3 and then a refusal on mine. And her fields are horrid. It's ridiculous. You still remember her name, I'm assuming. Yeah, Deanna Griegel. Yeah. I know. What a liar. Can I see those? I'm going to need those small ones. There we go. Thanks. Thank you. You're not allowed to do that. Just go and step out. You need to step out. Actually, you're not. You're on the phone. You need to step out. No, you're not, actually. Are you lying to me again? Yes, you are. You need, to, you need to step out. You need to step out. Okay, I will. Please do not walk in on me. I'm not. Yes, you are. You're, you're abiding in the law. Um, you need to step out, ma'am. Excuse me? You need to step out of the room. Okay, can you get out of here? You need to step out of the room, ma'am. So you're on now? Yep, Please and the door's the not fully open. Whenever you're ready to step out. Are you unable to follow instructions? No, I'm... Okay, waiting on you. Waiting on you, ma'am, whenever you're ready to step out. Come on out. You're on the phone now. I already know. I can hear you. You're a liar. <laughs> Come on out. Whenever you're ready. Come on out. Okay. I'm actually not. Yes, you're not a woman cop. Whenever you're ready. Come on out. You can stop lying to me. You're already on the phone. You might as well tell them. Tell them that you're abiding by the law. I am abiding by the law. That is correct. Thank you. I recorded you. So am I. Camera's always on, remember? Yes. Sorry, please do not walk down. I'm not. I know you want it. I don't want to touch you while I was going in the car. Whatever you say. Um, I have proof. It's all on video. Okay, cool. I have proof. Okay. Um, actually, I'm not allowed to. So, whenever you're ready to come out, come on out. Okay, thank you. Don't touch me again. Thank you. I have my uncle. <laughs> okay. Okay. I know the law. Sure. Do not touch me again, please. Whatever you say. Okay. Okay. Cool. It's all on video. The whole thing's on video, man. You can say whatever you like. Alright, we're in the place that way now. I'm gonna put you back in cuffs. Why? Turn around.
being processed for DWI again. Well, you're being processed for um, Okay, you can okay, say whatever you like. It's all on video. Okay. The whole thing. But then again, you're a liar, so who's going to believe you? Okay, have a seat for me. Whatever you say, man. Yeah, okay. So, oh, you blew a 1 1 last time. You remember him? That's the guy that arrested you last time, a couple weeks ago? Shocking, it is. You're welcome. Taking another drunk driver off the streets. You're welcome. Whatever you say, man. So full of it. Okay. Okay, and we have video of everything. Now she's saying that I touched her while I put, while I put her, her in the car. I know, my right. And yes, you did touch It's all on Before video. Good luck. I have Good. Okay. So do we. Whatever you say. There's actually a nurse at the jail is the one that you can actually be speaking to.
said from the 15th to the 22nd, right? Or whatever that we get? Uh, 19th through the 20, whatever, yeah. Okay. Or something like that. Yeah, I just barely get back to the Okay. Yeah, I'll, uh, it's, it's, uh, the 22nd to the 29th? Yeah. Do what? What do you say? Okay. Okay. So, what do you want me to call rescue for? You want me to call rescue for you for what? I have to tell them why. I have to tell them why you want rescue to come out here. Okay. So, what do you want me to call them out for?
I already called them. What's up? I don't go down there. Started rescue. They're on their way. What happened? Oh, she's gonna accuse me of all kinds of good no. stuff. That's all on video. Are you serious? Yeah. The whole interaction's on video, from start to finish. So, good luck. Good luck. Obviously not. This is your second one in a month. It's your second one in a month. I don't call that good luck, man. I'd call it bad luck. Say whatever you like. She's saying that I touched her when the whole thing's on video. My same reaction, too. What's up? She got stopped for a stop sign. Um, did a bunch of fields, bombed the heck out of them. Brought her down here. She's talking about how she's going to be a cop or something like that. About how she knows all of her rights. And then uh, we get done. She loads a 1 3, then refuses. And then she goes in the bathroom. I recorded her phone call. And uh, then she comes out and starts making all these accusations. But the whole thing's still on video because it's still running. So it's all on video. Good luck. 
You're a liar from the get-go. It is what it is. You do whatever you like. I don't want you to go to the bathroom with me either. So we'll do this as quick as we can. Right there, called rescue for her, and we're just waiting on them to show up because she requested them. So go from there. She said she wanted to talk to him. She said she wanted to have a medical exam. That's all she said. It's like calling down here. She gets on the cell phone. I can hear her. And then basically, I tell her to open the door. She doesn't. I open the door. Open about this much, which is all on video. Um, told her to step out. She told her to step out. She says, hang on. And then she flushes the toilet. And then she comes out and basically is making all kinds of weird accusations. And here we are. It's all on video. She can say whatever she likes. Yeah. It's in her shirt. They're on their way.
away from those guys down there. Have a seat in here for me. They're going to talk to you. Um, basically, the whole thing's on video. She's accusing me of touching her. And that's where we're at. And I, I guess she said she wanted to have you guys come check her out for a medical checkup. I don't know. If she, re if she requests you, I have to call you out here. Um, she's making whatever allegations, and I've got a video to back everything up, so I'm not worried about it. Yeah, man. What's she um, Super DWI. Okay. okay. What's your name? Um, Miss Griegos. I'll take Griegos? your 49 if you get her. Yeah. Let me get her ID for you. Yeah. Hmm? No kidding. Her second in, uh, like her second, like in two and a half weeks, because JJ just got her like two weeks ago. <laughs> Obviously. I know. That's fine. Whatever she wants to do. I know, I was already thinking about that. I was already thinking about that. Why oh, not? Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. That's fine. Thank you. I'm 